Yo, what's going on, 67 Linux Squad? And it is Wednesday, and patch day was yesterday, which means, which means, Mamad is in the duel, baby. I get to see to her. Shine. I get to see her in duel. I get to see how she goes. Also, this skin goes unbelievably hard. Like, it, it's too much. It's actually too much. It's 7 in the morning, and my, my, my little virgin eyes can't handle this. Immortality has bestowed All right. upon um, me the power and allure of the night, and I intend to make the most of it. I could honestly go. I could honestly go Chronos Pendant. Um. I don't know what I want to start with. I'm going to try Chronos Pendant this game. I'm going to try out Chronos Pendant this game. I don't really know if Chronos Pendant is actually going to be the way I want to start her. Like, mainly in general, but... I'm down to give it a shot. I don't need my three. I guess it does do initial damage. Does it hit minions? Uh, She dashed forward, passing through player-made... Passing through player-made walls... And damaging enemies. I can dash through your mirror wall and stuff. And Kabraken wall. Oh. That's pretty insane. Alright. Alright. Blue buff acquired. That's a really good buff clear by the way. Also if you don't know. What Mammon does. You probably should uh, spend some time. Go watch the first look video. I went over all of her abilities. Her entire kit. The ins and outs of everything you need to know. Um, so, it'll help you out a little bit. Bro, my damage is actually crazy. But I don't think I'm dashing into your, your tower right now yet. Not yet, not yet. Oh, sniped with my two. Dude, the, like, the damage is just so much. Like, this god... This god is absurd, man. And I know, by the way, before, like, anyone says it, like, I know they nerfed her. Technically, she... This is the nerfed version of Mummin. But, like, it's too much. I think I could actually kill him again. Like unironically, I think I probably I probably could have stayed, fought that, and won the fight. Which is just insane, man. But whatever. It's okay. Also, if you're wondering why my nose is a little runny, it's not because it's stuffed. Like I can actually breathe out of my nose. But um it's runny because I just woke up and it's like fucking sixty degrees in my house. You have no chance here. I missed. Boom! Isn't this god ridiculous? Like... My one did 623 damage. Oh, my clear is not too great, to be honest with you, but... That's okay. Why did he start Aussie? I guess... I guess it's not terrible. Like, you don't really need to start Golden Blade. But Aussie seems a little bit excessive. Oh my god. So if you're wondering why I'm using my one and then canceling my one, your one is based off of this little, like, bar, I guess. Kind of like Pele's three. Except the bar doesn't recharge until you use the stun. So the little fire breath I'm using, when I use my one, it uses some of the, the juice for my little bottle. 
And then whenever I use my stun like this, my bottle breaks and my cooldown on my one starts. If you don't use your stun, you have no cooldown on your one, as you can see. Um, and then also, if you use your stun early, because you can use your stun whenever you want. It's not like you don't have to use the one like me. Like you can stun right now if you wanted, you know? Um, are you dead? No. But if you use your stun early, the cooldown on your one is longer. You're ulting me, but you're also dead. You're ulting me, but you're also deceased. Oh, also, there is one thing I forgot to mention in my first look video, which is actually a very, very, very big mechanic of this god that I completely overlooked. And it was, it's pretty honestly stupid that I did. And it's the fact that your two, when I was first talking about the two, I only mentioned the fact that it, um, it makes you do increased damage. But what it also does is it doubles the applying marks on them. Which means your passive procs twice as fast. I missed. You're dead though. <laughs> Bless me. Your passive procs twice as fast. Which is the majority of your damage as you can tell. I mean, actually, the majority of my damage right now is my one. Probably just because I'm maxing it and because he doesn't have a lot of health, but... But regardless, over time, the majority of your damage is going to be your ult. I mean, your passive. He's got that defense online now. Look at that clear. Look how clean that clear is with your two. Look how look how clean the damage is too. I'm dead. Dash away. JK, I'm back in. What's good, brother? Dude. This is but a scratch. Look, I know that I say this a lot right i know that i say this a lot this god is busted i have played her in four conquest games and three dual matches and i have gone ridiculously over kd ratio like i'm like i'm talking i've gone like 10 and 1 or like 15 and 2 or some shit every single game it's just stupid like why am i allowed to do that much damage against somebody with defense and lifesteal why can i do that much damage I don't get it, dude. I don't get it. All right, let's go. Honestly, let's just go more life steal. And I'll grab this and I'll go the Bancroft's Claw. <clears throat> so, Mammon is the only magical assassin in the game other than Ao Kuang. So, Ao Kuang now has a buddy. Um, and on top of that, she's not auto attack based. She's an ability based magical assassin, which it is a first for smite. So that's actually really interesting. Are you alting? Oh, you're, you're surrendering. You're not even going to waste time to alt. <clears throat> um, I'm going to queue up again and play another mom in game because that was like
That was too easy. I gotta, I gotta go again. Welcome back, boys, to game number two. I was just prio queued for over an hour. Literally prio queued for over an entire hour just to try to get this game. I should have already been streaming, to be honest with you. And I still haven't even finished my first video yet. This is absurdity. I'm a little tilted. <laughs> I'm a little tilted that it took me literally an entire hour to get a single match. That's genuinely that should never happen, but oh, well, oh, well, it's fine. It's fine. We're fine. It's fine. No big deal. Why do you have your I don't know why he has his three because I don't think getting your three to start is good. I also don't know why he just like completely all into me before minions started, including using his horn shard when like literally nothing came from it. Okay. Okay. Time to find a new Unleash your wrath. Mm. Interesting. Interesting. I definitely cannot do that. It will kill me. I'm just gonna back. Let's savor this moment. I'm about a hundred gold ahead right now. That's pretty good. I bought a chalice too. We'll see what he goes for. He went Chronos Pendant also. Also, he used his Aegis, right? I'm pretty sure he used his Aegis. I don't like him starting his three early. I feel like that's kind of a waste. But what do I know? Yeah, I feel like I'm much stronger than him right now. Here we go. Red buff down. I have double buff. I also still have my Aegis up. <laughs> all right my sweet all right pretty close this is but a scratch pretty close but not bad pretty close but not bad I still have horn shard too that I could have used I wonder what he's leveling. Because his one did 13 ticks and still did less than my than my one. Mm. Might be able to kill him here, actually. Yeah. Uh. He just straight ran the whole time. He just straight running. Oh, I missed. Oh, I missed again. Damn. Close. He's got alt up. You're not going to fight? Oh, you are going to fight. Oh, I should be dead. Oh, I 
guess he saw me. I guess he saw me. Just back in now. All right. This is going to be one of those games that's like... Because we're the same character, it's going to be so annoyingly back and forth. I'm going to hit him and then he's going to hit uh, me and then I'm going to hit him and then he's going to hit me and then one of us is going to die and barely live. The other guy's going to barely live, you know? Your middle tower is under attack. But also... Also, that's, that makes it kind of a good game. A red buff down. He plays very scared. Oh, I missed. He just stayed in me the whole time. I missed. I missed. He circle a rooskied on me, man. Oh, I'm in I mean, it's interesting that he just backed. Like, he just straight up backed there. I missed. I'm dead now. Ah, close. Close. Any more cooldown? Staff of Mirren would go unbelievably hard here. Uh, but I also think that Lifesteal goes unbelievably hard. And... I actually think after starting Chronos Pen in both games, I think Bancrofts feels better. Because once you get Bancrofts online, you just feel that much stronger. You know what I mean? Maybe you don't know what I mean. I, Let me pass on the torch. I'm actually just bad. I'm actually just terrible at this video game. Never mind. Turns out that I'm dog shit. I'm also tilted as like beyond belief right now because it took me an entire hour to get a second match. When in reality, I should have been done. I should have been done with all of my recording right now. I think I'm only tilted because I'm like really busy today. Because I have to stream today and I have to go to my parents' house today. Whatever. It's only going to take longer if I keep fucking around, so let's focus, shall we? make the it didn't even make the
Um, I'm definitely going... Actually, I'm going to go beads. Although I do think that blink would go crazy. I think in a mirror match, beads might be better. It's a pretty even game right now. You knock up immune. Are you knock up immune in your one? Wait, are you? Are you not? I can't even knock up, knock back immune while channeling. I had no idea. But I actually had no idea that you could use the one. To stop the alt knock up. Okay, so I should not have gone beads then. I should not have gone beads then. This game is going to shit very, very, very fast. And so is my mental. I'm in an all time mental, mental collapse. Dude, I don't know why so many people buy 500 pots, man. I will never understand it. Unless you get like six kills with that 500 pot, it's not worth it. Like, there's literally no point in doing that. I knew he was going to blink. This guy plays more scared than a newborn mother holding her baby in a den of lions. More scared than that. So the fact that he was 1 HP and he didn't back. The most obvious blink play of my life. There's his ult. I missed. That might be my Phoenix, actually. He's got a full minion wave. I need, um... I could go Divine, but, like, he's got no anti-heal. Or no healing, I mean. He's obviously using his one much better than I am. I don't know how to do it that well. But what I do know... Is Smite. So I think I can still win this game. He knows Mammon way more than I do, but, like... But I know Smite way more than he does. Also, um, this god is so OP. Like, like, but the fact that these fights are like fights is fucking insane. Oh, 
I killed myself. Never mind. I killed myself. going magis i think this guy watches infamous jesse a lot that's my guess because jesse makes that dumbass 500 pop play <laughs> and by the way jesse knows it's a dumbass play i don't know why he does it but he makes that dumbass 500 pop play and he loves magis so This guy's just playing like, like, like Jesse, basically. Except he sold it and is now going life steal, which is a bad play because I wanted divine anyways. Oh, that's not good. All right. That didn't do anything. I guess it got my Aegis, but like... Him getting my Aegis right now, I don't think means much because I am not going to immune in my one. So like... And I don't think Mom and Alt actually does that much damage, right? It's about the knockup. I mean, uh, actually, that that's kind of a lot of damage. It's like 800. Almost. All right. Obliterated. I'm just thinking about the matchup. Like, if I started Bancroft, that game would have been so much better for me. That game would have been so much better if I just if I just started Bancroft. Like every good mage should. I mean, obviously, there's some ages where you start Chronos Pendant, like fucking Hera and Vulcan and stuff like that. But like. Bancroft also works on them, no matter how good it is, you know? But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, guys, peace.